Yo, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, Everything TV, and I'm coming at you with another banging video. And today, we're going to talk about my workout and what I have been doing and how I'm enjoying this weekend. Let me go ahead and click over here. I'm just doing like a little analysis for you guys just to show you guys, I believe, the days that we are on. We are on day eight, I believe, right? Last time it was, okay, yeah, it was day four and five. So we're on six and seven. Um, we're on day six and seven, and I just want to say, guys, I feel freaking amazing, phenomenal, uh, perfectly fine, great. Uh, you know, um, I enjoyed a little bit of a cheat day on Friday and a cheat day today as well. Um, by the time you're seeing this, it's Saturday. Uh, but I enjoyed a little bit of a cheat day, and I'm feeling really, really good. I had a chicken sandwich that was out. I didn't cook it. But it was a chicken sandwich, nonetheless, and my weight did stay relatively uh, the same, so I feel pretty good. Um, we, I've been staying active. It's not like I haven't really not been active. I just been kind of having been not so strict to my diet. I'm gonna have to pick that back up, obviously. Um, today, tonight, you're gonna see that in my tonight stream where I'm gonna go ahead and. Uh, do an exercise bike we did get a new exercise bike so that's all set up ready to go I, I will be streaming that on this stream uh i woke up this morning uh sent out a pokemon card that i uh have to send out to someone that bought a card for me i sent out one of these charizard cards this morning uh, i bought three of them of these cards and i sent out uh one of them so i have two of them left so that's what I did. I don't know. I figured I might as well just sell it because why not, right? Um, so I will start my morning like that with a cup of coffee as well. First cup of coffee I've had in quite some time, uh, in about a week. So I had a cup of coffee and my wife was like, hey, let's go to the beach. So we pretty much went to the post office and went to the beach and we're, were there for like two hours maybe just swimming, getting some good exercise, burning some calories on the sun. Uh, had stayed hydrated, but it was it was a fairly fairly decent time. I mean, I've been just really I've I've been really feeling good. Um, even after eating the chicken sandwich, I kind of didn't really let myself, you know, um, feel too bad about it. But I will be working out twice twice as hard today. I'm gonna probably hit like probably like I'm gonna try to aim. I'm aiming for an hour on this workout bike. But I don't know um, how it's going to be on this workout bike. Um, but I'm going to try and see if I can manage at least about an hour. I don't know. My butt kind of hurts when I get on it. But I'm going to try for an hour and see how that goes. Hopefully, all goes well on that workout bike. Um, obviously, that would be great if it would work and I can do an hour. But it's my first time using a workout bike. So it's going uh, to be interesting to say the least. Um but yeah, that's what I've been doing for the last couple of days, six and seven. We are technically on day, no, I think we're on day eight because day seven was, oh yeah, we're on day eight, nine. We're on day nine. Yeah, we're on day nine. Excuse me. Yeah, we're on day nine. Last video was six, seven. Yesterday was eight. Today's nine. So we're doing eight, nine. This is eight, nine. Um, and those two days are cheat days. Now, listen, I don't want to incur decourage anybody from not wanting to have a little cheat day uh there's nothing wrong with uh cheating it's just over indulging uh, what do i mean by over indulging is like you work hard all week have six sodas in a day eat three bags of chips fast food for lunch breakfast and dinner that's over indulging what i say is like you work hard all day work hard all week maybe have like an ice cream bar or one can of soda or a bag of chips something small not nothing big that's gonna just make your work go all the way sorry about that but that that's what I'm talking about when I say um, overindulging I I enjoyed just a little bit of stuff you know I'm not gonna lie to you guys but I checked my weight my weight was the same uh, we're gonna try this week to get in the 70s which will be a huge accomplishment which will be roughly about almost 20 pounds so today's Saturday. I'm gonna work out hard today. I'm gonna work out hard Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and we'll weigh ourselves that Friday. Uh, so which will be a, probably around 20 days. It'll be about 20 days into this workout, and I'm and I'm lost about 20 pounds. My goal 
um, by next Friday is to have lost already 20 pounds in two weeks, you see? And that's insane, right? 20 pounds, two weeks. But you guys been the ones to see me through this whole process. I started out at 290 pounds and I got down to 282 pounds in seven days, which is a full week. So another full week, I do plan on getting down seven more pounds, which will bring me to 14 pounds. But I'm hoping I can over... Do it and push it to 20 pounds. That would be ideal if I can push it to the 20 pounds. That'll be pretty crazy, pretty tough to do. But that's what I'm aiming for is that 20 pound weight loss. If I can hit that, that'll be like perfect. That's my goal. Um, so that's what we're looking forward in week two. Uh, if you guys are at home and you're still trying to, um, you know, if you guys are trying to, you know, push through just just rewatch my old videos for motivation rewatch some of my old workout videos for motivation it's very possible to do these things i'm not doing i'm not taking any crazy supplements i'm taking a multivitamin uh that boost in energy that's it um and and it's just willpower and the power of community um if i can make hit my goal so what i'm at one i'm at 182 now so i'm assuming 270 would be um 270 would be 20 pounds obviously so two, 20 pounds in two weeks which would make a great video um but that's how you do it man you just have to have that willpower and um you know hey buddy leave it alone you have to have sorry about that you have to have that willpower and that support so um it's very possible i think i'm gonna do it uh, i'm right there i'm at seven pounds now I think in another week, another seven full days. And plus, I got these two weekends to really, like, kick it in. I think I'll probably lose, like, five pounds this weekend. Um, and we'll be at our target weight. So pretty much, like I said, you know, how to lose this weight is pretty pretty common sense. You know, a lot of people just, I think a lot of people don't have the willpower, obviously, to, um, sorry about that, I'm just fixing my camera. A lot of people obviously don't have the will so the willpower to kind of, fight it and i understand because it's it's hard for me too you know it, it's really hard for me too to uh do this and sorry <laughs> my camera's all tripping it's, it's really hard for me to do this as well so if you guys didn't know as well we have a brand new camera looks amazing look at that beautiful camera um but i know a lot of people struggle with self-control um but i just want to let you know man it's it's really it really is the first week um it really is the first week guys once you get past the first week this the self-control it gets easier, and then you can reward yourself, but it does get easier. I mean, like I said, like I said again, the kind bars um, really, really, really help. Um, the kind bars really, really help, and um, that's what I've been doing, substituting just the junk food for, for good, healthy snacks and alternative snacks. I mean, that's really what it's all about, and then working out and committing to that workout. And, I mean, I've, I've ran this week in seven days, I've ran about four miles about four miles i think about four miles which is not a lot no eight miles i ran about eight miles which i know it's not a lot but compared to where i started which was running zero miles a week it's it's a huge improvement so you know you got to um you know better better yourself and accept your your accomplishments which is what i'm i'm doing so i'm very happy with the results i'm very happy that i'm able to do such and, you know, you guys sh really should be too as well, you know, just be proud of what, where you're at because every effort you take to better yourself is an effort that's well, well noticed and well needed. And any effort you take to better yourself betters you than the day that you were before. So example, if you're 400 pounds, but you're taking one step to better yourself tomorrow, then you're already doing better than you were that previous day. Even if it's a small step, you're bettering yourself than you were in the past bettering yourself is is amazing and i feel great doing it and i know a lot of people are going to be amazed at it so um i just want to bring you know this your attention guys you guys can do it i've been craving sodas i haven't been drinking sodas i had a soda i'm not gonna lie i had a soda today and yesterday um one can that's it and that was it, you know, and I know you're like, well, don't do it. But I don't really, I didn't really, I don't, I'm not really craving them no more. It was just more of like a, let me enjoy myself, you know, instead of going out eating five pounds of junk shit. Let me enjoy myself and have one Coke, you know. Um, and I feel great. So 
Um, my overall mood is a lot better. So just keep going, guys. I really appreciate everybody who's been watching. My love to every single one of you beautiful people. And remember, guys, stay healthy, stay positive, and kick that fat, guys. I'll catch y'all on the next video. My love to every single one of you beautiful people, guys. Make sure you drop a like and subscribe to the channel. How to lose weight in 20 pounds video coming out next week, guys. My love to every single one of you people. Peace. How to lose 20 pounds in two weeks. Peace.